All right. Let's see it. Oh god, what is it? What is it? Ah, punch him. Punch him. I don't like him. Ready? Jet. Go, 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 go. Oh god, it's scared. Whoa. What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of Subnautica TBF Gaming here. Modded Subnautica Day. I'm so excited to get back into this. So what we're doing is I kind of cut out all the other side stuff. We're still doing daily arc like we normally do. But our second video on the days where I can get a second video up is going to be modded Subnautica until I can beat that. We're going to beat this one and then we're going to move on to either we're going to finish up the forest or we're going to move on to Green Hill or we're going to do subsistence. I don't know. We're going to do one of those other side games. I want to make sure that we're doing a little bit of side content instead of just arc all the time. Uh, but this is what we're working on right now. I've got some serious base changes going. You can kind of see it back here. I've got just a little bit of stuff back here. Let me show you down below. You know, actually, let's wait till daytime. We'll go inside and I'll show you some stuff in there first. As we're doing this, if you enjoyed today's video, hit the like button, subscribe for new, leave a comment down below. All those things. Thank you so much for support on the recent videos. So we finally got a couple of the modded things up so we can show you some of the cool little side stuff. And we also got some stuff just going for us. I got lots of storage. Uh, now, I would like to use the bigger, better storage stuff, but we just don't have the materials for it yet. So we'll get working on that as soon as we can. But we, we definitely want to use the which one is it the the big glass ones the locker just gives you a little bit more space i just didn't want to use up all the quartz because we want to use it for some other things but we'll get into that i did finally make a battery charger so we have a battery charger here now on the wall in fact oh there we go everything's charged up nice give me these guys right yeah there we go let's get is any more that are zero all right we need that one that one that one and i think that's it there we go. Nice. We'll get these charged up. Now, we do run out of power sometimes at night times. So there's a good chance that this will make us run out of power. We've got 149 and 150 right now, but you can see how fast it drains once you start putting this stuff on there. Uh, but let's hurry and get these. We'll put these back over here. And then I still need to make the moon pool again. I did break that down, so I need to make that again real quick here in the next few minutes. We'll get into that. Uh, man, I really want to show you the rest of the base. We'll get there in a second. All right, let's stay focused just for a second. So now this area over here is going to be one giant alien containment. I want to make like a gigantic, ridiculously large one. And then it goes all the way down to here, down to the first level. And this is, I guess, where we'll start the alien containment unit. I guess we should do that now. So let's go, let's see. I think it's interior piece and alien containment. Bam, there we go. We'll get this crafted up real quick. Need to go ahead and get our our stuff going here so we can eventually get power using these. I think it'd be really cool. Let's get a door on here. Let's see, we need a hatch. We'll put that over here on the back side. There we go. Hopefully I have enough stuff for it. There we go, bam, there you go. All right, there you go. And you see inside here, you've got room to go ahead and put some stuff. And then what I'll do is up above this will be another one. So we're gonna work on another one in just a minute. I think you can continually just do these do this over and over but i'm not 100 percent sure we'll have to kind of see about that anyways let's go talk about some of the modded stuff upstairs i got just a couple of the very very simple mods put in up here and that is number one the clock look a clock how cool is that now i did do a lot of stuff on my own i went and did uh some of the data logs and stuff over at the island and then down at the tagasi base so we could unlock the next step in the story we're going to get back to that. Now, this other mod, so that's the clock mod, just so we can see what time it is in-game. It's 2.17. Awesome. You can also click it, and it'll show you what time it is in real life, so you can see what time I'm recording. And this video is supposed to be out in like an hour, so we'll see if we can do that. I don't think we're going to make it. All right, the other one is a resource monitor. There's two different versions of this. There's this one, and then an extra large one. It's really cool. Look at that. It tells you like all the different stuff you have there. Oh, can I click it? <gasps> I can grab it out of there. That's the greatest thing I've ever seen. I didn't know that. All right, cool. But you can cycle through. No, 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 no. You can cycle through the pages and see all the stuff that we have in all these different inventory boxes that are within like a certain distance. How cool is that? I've got everything kind of organized. I've got all my iron over here. Iron, iron. This is just a drop box because I didn't know what to do with it just yet. Uh, eggs, some sulfur, copper, ores, glass. I think, where's, where's gold go? Hold on. Gold is over fish. Gold and silver. Here we go. Go ahead and throw that bad boy over there. There you go. Some diamond and ruby. Uh, this one's still empty. I got food, fish, and planter stuff. And then over here we've got all of our batteries. The batteries and the one power cell. And then we've got tools, which is just our all of our random tools. And 
our bedroom stuff that we took from the downstairs area as well. So <gasps> we're getting light out. Yes, I can show you the base. All right, so we broke down everything we had below. So everything that was down here. All right. Uh, minus a camera for some reason. Everything else is gone. I got rid of all of the base over there, and we built brand new right over here. And this is what we have so far. So I've got this giant contraption that's going to be all of those alien containment facilities. Just a whole bunch of them. It's going to be absolutely awesome. And then that goes across to the main room and then across to our little grow plots over here. And then we're going to do the same thing on the other side and another one of these giant ones here. I don't know if it'll be another containment facility or if we'll put something else in there. I haven't decided that yet, but we'll figure that out. All right, let's go down here. And then, yeah, that's that's the main thing we got done today. Now I need to go ahead and make ourselves, what is the other thing called? The, we need the, the moon pool, moon pool. We need moon pool. This is an absolute must. Uh, we're going to put it over here. Let's go like that. Why can't I seem to connect it here? Okay, maybe not. Am I lining it up incorrectly here? Okay, maybe it should go on the other side. Maybe we're putting it on the wrong side. Here we go. How will it look right there? Let's see. We definitely have all the stuff for it. Okay. Uh, that definitely hurt our stability a little bit. Let's try that again. I want it to do the legs. Maybe we should put down another one of the foundations. Maybe we should do that. So let's do this. Let's put it on this side. We can put it over here. All right. So we'll go moon pool here. All right. How's that look? I think that's right. There we go. Get that all crafted up. Bam. Oh, we definitely did not put it right. Hold on. There we go. That should connect him, hopefully. Bam. Got it. Okay, nailed it. All right, so there's that. And then we got to go on the inside, and we have to fix up the upgrade stuff. So go in here. Let's go ahead and get our the upgrade interior piece vehicle upgrade station. There we go. There you go. Just all the little things we got to knock out real quick. Bam. Got it. All right. Now, we'll get the Seamoth back in here so it'll charge up and be good to go. But there you go. St slowly starting to build this out and make it look even better and better. We'll get all kinds of mo more stuff going on here as soon as we can. But, yeah, I think that looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and put a... I think I got enough to do one of the reinforcements on the side over here. All right there. There you go. This will improve the stability quite a bit. Bam. There you go. Plus seven takes us to an eight. Nice. All right. We'll go up and get the sea moth real quick. Make sure we have lots of food and water. And then we're going to go ahead. Let's see. No, not there. This way. We're going to go ahead and head out to the next spot that we got to go to. I did get another one of the life pods as well. And we went out and found some like electric looking fish that were pretty crazy looking. All right. If we don't need to charge this up, we're just going to head out. So let's go. Oh, you know, what? let's make sure we have all of our tools that we need. I think we're going down somewhere deep, dark, and scary. We'll go like this. Um, we'll take that. We'll take that. Repair tool. And what is that? Grav trap. I'll take one of these. All right. Let's go ahead and switch out for better batteries. All right. Battery, 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 battery. Let's do this. Let's make sure everything has something here. There you go. Alright, that one's 100%. 100%. Alright, this one needs something. There we go. We'll get all these to 100% and then we'll go ahead and roll out. Alright, battery. Okay, where's all the zeros? Alright, let's go. We're on the road. So as long as this guy doesn't really need to heal up or get fixed up or anything, we're going to go ahead and roll out right now. Let's get a little bit of the bobo trees. We're doing good there. There you go. Perfect. And let me grab one emergency water, one emergency med kit, and one food. So we'll go like that. And we'll go food. We'll go one, two, three. All right, last things last. We'll do fish. I'm going to grab all the fish. Two of those, two of those, and two of those. And then we're going to grab the eggs. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Perfect. All right, let's go throw this down here real quick. All right, and then we'll go. Can I do it from right here? Let's see if we can. All right, let's go like this and alien containment. Can I put it up there? Oh, I can't do it from down here. Okay. What if I go outside? We'll go outside and then we'll try to make a door in. Like this. All right, perfect. And then we we'll go like this and bam. If we can make this, that gives us a pretty pretty good sized little tank down here. Got it? Bam. Look at that. Very, very cool. I love how it joins together. I think that's super cool. Uh, if we can make one more, we'll do one more. Alright. Alright, like so. And then do it one more time here. Got it. Alright, and then we'll do the same thing inside of here. Oh, that's as much as we got. Okay, so we're, we don't have enough to do that. All right, that's that's fine. Now, ooh, can I can I get rid of this? Oh no! <gasps> what if I trap myself inside? Hold on. Get rid of the hatch. Got it. Okay. Now, what I what I want to do is see. Can I put a hatch right here? Oh, that's too bad. That would have been amazing. Okay. Okay, let's put it back in so we can get out. I'm glad we didn't get trapped just now. There we go. All right. Let's take this back off. Bam. Okay, so at least we have a little bit in there. Let's go ahead and throw all these fish in there. I think you just jump in. Right? You jump in and you just release them, right? So we go like this and we go... Where's the fish? So we go drop, 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 drop. Bam, and just like that, we've got fish everywhere. Now these guys, oh, they're hatching. Look, look, look. They're hatching. Oh my God, that's so cool. Look, it's a little buddy. Oh my goodness, we're gonna have little friends. Unless they eat us, then they're not gonna be very friendly. All right, there you go. So by the time we get back, we should have some little baby fish friends. Really, really cool. Very, very cool. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get on the road or in the water or whatever it is you want to call it. Okay. I think we're doing good on everything else. Let's go. So here we go. We're going down to the next spot of the storyline, which is the next Degasi proposed site, which is way down here. Now, this is in kind of a scary area, so I don't know if we can really do much there. I think it's somewhat below. Looks like it's below the island or really close to it. We'll have to see how that works. But I went around. I got all the data banks. If you guys want to watch that, definitely go go out and search up those storyline stuff. I think they do a really good job with it. We'll definitely... Uh, I, I'd really enjoyed it. But I didn't want the whole video to be nothing but that. So I, I kind of cut it out. But yeah, we did record it. But it wasn't really much going on. And I was so tired that my recordings were absolutely awful. And <laughs> I don't know. I, just, I didn't feel good about the videos that we recorded. So I figured it was a good time to go ahead and just kind of start from scratch. Show you guys what we're getting into now. And then hopefully make a little bit of progress this way. Now we gotta go way over here into the unknown. This is a really cool area. It gets very, very, very dark. Hopefully you guys can still see okay. Uh, I still haven't been able to get very much of this, of the stalker teeth. Like does he drop a tooth when he does that? I don't know. See, I don't see one. Oh well. All right, focus, focus. Let's go this way. Pro propose the gassy habitat. So we're going all the way towards the island and then pretty much straight down from the island, but we'll stay along this little edge here. I just think it looks really cool as you get further out, watch. Uh, I really do want to search everything, but we're gonna focus. All right, here we go, through this little reef area. Look how much stuff there is to pick up. Oh, here we go, what is this? This is kind of cool looking, look at this. Alright, I am going to grab a few things. Just because I'm missing quite a few things. Gold, nice. Okay. Mobile vehicle bay we don't need, but we'll go ahead and do that. Alright. Oh, and I, I want to pick this stuff up, but I'm not going to pick up the scrap just yet. 
We really need glass and quartz, so we'll try to keep an eye out for that. Where's our flashlight? There we go. Salt deposit. Okay, let's keep going. Alright, jump back in, and let's go. Alright, time to start going down. This is where it gets a little bit crazy. You start seeing these giant floating things. I don't really know what they are. Can I do anything with them? I need to scan them. Okay. It's an anchor pod. Scan this guy. Okay. Oh, it's a life form? Really? Nothing. Okay. I just wasn't sure. Was not sure. All right. This is where we're headed right here. There you go. This is definitely the deepest we've been so far. Okay, I think, what is my limit right now? 300 meters? Uh, that's it. Go back up. Go back up. Okay, so this is as deep as we can go now. Stop going below three. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. Look at that down there. I don't know what's down there. It looks scary, though. All right. It's only 200 meters away. We're so close. Stop creeping down that low. I guess we shouldn't keep our back to the giant ocean of scariness. <laughs> let's, let's avoid doing that. I was also trying to see if there's anything else that we can find supply-wise. Look at this place, man. Alright, so far nothing's sneaking on us, so that's good. Oh, I hear something. I don't hear anything. Like I hear an occasional noise here and there, and I get a little little skittish. Oh, here we go. Is this where we're supposed to go? It's basically straight below us, isn't it? I've lost it. It's straight below us. It's only 200 meters. It's really close. We're going in through here? No, nothing in here. We should see what we have down here supply-wise. Right, we have... Alright, didn't really need it, but that's fine. Alright. This game, it gets really claustrophobic down here. Alright, let's find more. There's got to be, like, some kind of entrance that takes us down below. It's been a long time. <gasps> wait a minute, wait a minute. This is huge. This is what I needed. I've been looking for this right here. Let's go grab it. Okay, hold on. Scan it first so we can know what it is. This is for the aerogel, I do believe. All right, grab it. Give it to me, thank you. Yeah, that's awesome. All right, there's that. Oh, look in here. Okay. Got all kinds of crazy looking stuff. Just keep an eye on your oxygen. Definitely freaky looking. Uh, let me. Can I do anything with this? Membrane tree. Not really sure. Alright, let's get back to the sea moth. Yep, I'm hurrying, I'm hurrying. Okay. I'd like to go a little bit more in there. I'd like to know if there's really... Oh, nope, 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 nope. Leave me alone. Nope. All right, leave that guy alone. Okay. Is he still chasing? No, he's still chasing. Dang, at least we found the one thing we needed. We needed the arrow gel. <gasps> What's this? Okay, what is that? Oh, it's a time capsule. What's in there? Oh, we got all kinds of stuff. Synthetic fibers. Okay. That was a cool find. Alright, how do I get back? It's so dark. This way. Alright, let's go see what we can do with this arrow gel because I think that's one of the things we desperately needed. We still need magnetite. That's the next thing we got to find, but we find lots of cool supplies otherwise. Well 
Oh, bad driving. All right, back at the base place. Let's go ahead and do this. We're going to run inside. Oh, what is that? Charging 87%. It does repair it too, right? We repair it. Yes, health went up. All right, sweet. So that, that will be good to go there. Let's go ahead and go up top. Oh, how are you guys doing? How's our little fishy friends? Anybody new? Have you guys broke out yet? What's up, guys? Oh, they're coming soon. Soon, guys, soon. Nice. All right, let's go up top. And we'll see about this aerogel and synthetic fiber is what I believe we need. All right, so let's go like this. I like that. Advanced material. Aerogel, yes. Huge advancements. Bam. Okay, hold on. What do we need for the prawn suit? Let's go find out. Uh, let's go like this. Come here. Let's, let's do it. Please tell me that it's ready and I don't need like a whole bunch more stuff. <gasps> it's time. Oh my god. It Click it. First, a prawn suit oh my god, here we go. Here we go, here we go. I'm so excited. The prawn suit. Basically, we're an underwater Iron Man. Look at that. Yeah, man. Look at that awesome guy. Let's do it. Here we go, here we go. Oh, wait, you know what? Let's get our inventory put up first. We got the prawn suit, guys. All right, very cool. We are now underwater Iron Man. We'll get that going real quick. Let me see where I can drop most of my stuff here. Then we go iron. Oh, we got another egg. Nice. Let's go ahead and put that in the egg box. Egg. Just a little bit of copper action. And then eventually I'll have some bigger storage. This will be a lot easier. All right. Glass and quartz. All right. Gold is over here. Right there. Gold. Gold. Wow. We got lots of good stuff out of that. Look at all this stuff we got. So much cool stuff. All right. Dropbox maybe. Hmm. You know what? We can use some of this lithium. We'll probably use that in a second. Um, let me figure out where I can place this stuff. All right, there we go. I kind of just stuck into random boxes, but that'll work. All right, let's go see what we can do now. Go get the prawn suit. I don't remember if it gives you oxygen or not. I believe it does, right? Here it is. Look at it, guys. Oh, man. It's about to be epic. Here we go. Bam. Yeah. Here we go. I am Iron Man. Or Aqua Man. Aqua Iron? Iron Aqua. One of those. Alright, that's right. So it has a little bit of jet action, right? Alright. I got a left punch and a right punch. See no space, yes. Okay, so we need to see what kind of upgrades we can get for this. Also, can I possibly get to my moon pool? I don't know. Let's do it. Let's go like this. Let's go jump in this guy real quick. We'll move him out of the way. And let's see if we can do any upgrades for this guy. And let's definitely, definitely paint it. All right, let's see if we can jump high enough. All right, come on. Grab it. Ah, we made it. Perfect. There we go. Yeah, man, the prawn suit's in there. Very, very cool. All right, let's see what kind of upgrades we can make for it. I don't know if we have any of this stuff yet. Let's see. Command mo common mo modules. Storage. We definitely need that. Can I make that? Whole reinforcement. I need that. Uh, it says it's prawn and sea moth compatible, so we'll do that in a second. But let's look at the prawn suit stuff first. Torpedo arm, jump upgrade, thermal reactor, and depth module. I need plasteel and nickel. I don't have nickel yet. Okay. I definitely don't have that yet. But I do have the torpedo arm. But I probably can't make torpedoes yet because I don't have either of those things. Oh, my God. Okay, well, let's at least do the whole reinforcement. And the storage. Okay, so we'll put these two upgrades on real quick. And there's plenty of upgrade slots because of the way that this uh, this mod works. We have the extra improvements on there. You can see how many we can fit in there. So let's go like that. Like that. Upgrade that armor. And I think that's it for now, right? And then let's go ahead and paint this guy. Let's get him looking way better. Which one is it? What is that? No. Storage? No. I thought it was this one to paint it. Or is it this one? Aha, it's this one. All right. So base. I'm going to need you to be very, very blue is what I'm going for. There we go. No, that's the name. Base. Base blue. Yeah. 
and then interior will go all black and the stripe will go all white if we can there we go what do you think done all right, there we go. The big blue prawn suit. Oh, we need to rename it, of course. Uh, how do we name it? Here we go. Let's go. Okay, we're going to come right back to that. It sounded like we got one of our stuff. Uh, no, here it is. <gasps> there's our buddy. What's up, guys? Look at those little guys. Oh, there's all kinds of things in here. Look at these guys. Did they all hatch? Oh, a cuttlefish. What's up, cuttlefish? Okay. What's up, buddy? A crash fish. Okay. Anybody else need to get scanned in here? A mesmer. <gasps> I got that little mesmer guy. What's up, mesmer guy? Very cool. All right, let's get out of here. That's the one that was trying to hypnotize us early in the season when we were about to drown. All right, awesome. Now, do we have to get the drill? Can we not do any drilling action until we get the drill? Uh, thermal reactor, depth module, sea moth, no, common modules, speed boost, engine, engine, no. I thought he came with like a drill. Do I have to find that? It's the arms. I have to make certain arms, I think. That's what it is. Hold on. Yep, I know, I know, I know. We're hurting for for water. But I think you have to make some special arms for him. Let me see if I can figure out how to make that. Go like this. It's not on here, right? Just double check. Let's go like that. Vehicle. No. We still can't make the Cyclops. We can make the Neptune stuff really soon. Alright, I can make the Reinforced Dive Suit. Heavy synthetic fiber. Provide physical protection and advanced, enhanced survival in extreme temperatures. Yeah, this, that means I can go into the heat vent below us right now. Let's do this. Get that finish made up. Oh, man, it takes a long time to craft. Let's go. Do we already put it on? No, nope, reinforced suit. Bam. All right, reinforced gloves. Bam. All right, we already have the radiation helmet. All right, let's see if this works. So we'll go in here. And it should be this one right down here, right? So this is the one that we've we've looked at a few times, but I couldn't go inside. And now it should be safe, right? Let's go like this. Let's see if we get that, that heat. Yeah, now I can get close and get all this stuff. Should be some really good stuff in here, too. There we go. You still have to avoid the t the heat coming up. Some crystal action, nice. Get this stuff over here. It's kind of a big advancement coming in here. I'm really excited. There we go. All right, any other craziness? Look at that, some really good stuff in here. Very cool. All right. I'm trying to see. Let's get around a little quickly. I know it's going to be harder to see with this out. There we go. Alright, keep an eye on our oxygen. Alright, did just a little bit of exploring with the prawn suit. I think we're going to go ahead and take it off the edge to where we need to go to that next spot. I, I don't know if we should, should just yet, but we're going to go for it. So it is a long walk. It's going to take us a little while to get there. But let's go. Did I miss it? I completely missed it. Hold on. Come on. There we go. All right, let's try this again. Here we go. Prawn suit. Here we go. All right, we're headed towards the spot. It's going to be, it's a little hard to get there because everything is... <laughs> All, all the ground and everything is, it gets a little crazy in between here. So we're going to go kind of wide left. There we go. Yeah, I think we can do it this way. Let's go. All right, we're almost there. Time to start taking the plunge. Hopefully we can get down to this. The bad part is it's going to be really, really hard to get back. I think we'll be all right. We'll kind of figure out what's down here. And then if we can't get it back, we can always jump out and just swim straight to the top as fast as we can with our little uh, sea glide thing. 
So we'll do that. But there you go, 500 meters. Once we jump off this one over here, it's time to go down. We can go 900 meters deep, so we can go pretty far. We'll kind of see what's over here. Hopefully no leviathans. There we go. Get up here. I think this is it. I think this is the end of the line. Let's find out. There we go. All right, here we go. This should be the deepest we've been. 230. 280. And there we go. It's pretty cool. Definitely deeper than what we were allowed to go with that other thing. Is this it? Oh, I think this is it. Here we go. <gasps> oh, there's bad things down there. All right, we have these little scanner guys. Let's see what's down here. Okay. Oh, this is cool. Got the eerie music going. Okay. All right, uranite. Awesome, we got some uranite, whatever that is. Oh man, I don't really know which way to go. Looks like the habitat is this way. A titanium mass somewhere in this area. Unable to confirm whether it originated on the Aurora. It says a titanium mass. All right, jump over here. All right, about 100 meters away. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. What is that? No. What is that thing? Ah, run. Run, run. It sounds scary. Don't look back. Go, buddy. Go. Okay. Are we good? Everything's fine. Did I punch him in his face? Okay. Everything's good. <laughs> that was... Oh, God. They're still closer, aren't they? Oh, he's following? Oh, there he is. There he is. Where am I going? Okay, stay away, dude. Stay away. He needs to know that we can box. All right, let's go. Ah! Ah! What are we doing down here? Oh god, if we get teleported down here, it is over. I, I completely lost the spot. There's the camera. I'm so turned around right now. Oh, there it is. It's right there. 136 meters that way. Oh my god, how do I get up there? teleporter guys right there here's some more of the uranite got it okay all right let's go make a run for it go prawn suit go all right yep I hear him make it to this thing make it Make it. Got it. All right. Let's see it. Oh, God. What is it? What is it? Ah, punch him. Punch him. I don't like him. Okay. I wasn't scared. <laughs> We're fine. Okay. Let's start making our way up. 41 meters, guys. Let's do it. Okay, get ready to punch this brain in the head. Ready? Jet. Go, 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 go. Oh, God, it's scared. Whoa. Oh, there's a little little lag when that happened. Okay, here's the opening right here. Okay, land. Okay, who do I got to punch? Punch him. Punch him. Punch him. Oh. Oh, man. I think he's knocked out. I think we knocked him out. Take that. 
passing 100 meters. Okay, can we get Oxygen in here? <gasps> I can. Okay. Just keep an eye meters. out for data pads. And watch our oxygen. What do we got? Oh, what is it? Damaged pistol fragment. Scan it, scan it, scan it. Got it. Data box. We got swim charge fins. Nice. Abandoned PDA. Voice log seven. Please Let's do stop it. Stop fighting and listen. We're sick. What? How? You've been coughing, right? Feeling itchy? Blisters? Yeah. The biometrics would have warned us if we were sick. It's something new. It's not in the database. Come on, then. What's it gonna do? Turn us inside out? Dissolve us into jelly? It's an alien bacteria. It's everywhere. Every organism on this planet. It's altering our genetic code. Uh, how are the creatures surviving if they're infected? I don't know yet. Want me to cut some of them open for you? Find out what makes them tick? No. Just tell me what you need, son. Materials. Equipment. Just... Can I have some quiet? I need some time to think. Okay. Oh, no, no. No. Don't mess with me, please. All right, let's get back in the prawn suit. Not a fan of these guys. Go, 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 go. Okay, punch him. Punch him. Punch him. Where did he go? That happened. He, like, teleported us out of there. All right, how do I get to this other floor? Okay. I don't see another opening. Alright, are we safe for now? Let's go. Okay, how do I get in? There's no opening. Up here? No. There's a PDA. Is it right there? I don't have any idea. Get back in the thing. Get back in. Alright. Is it up top? Oh, there's another PDA. Here we go. Alright. Okay, grab the PDA. Integrating new PDA Paul Torgel's log, the end. Came out of nowhere. An alien kraken, bigger than a cyclops. Tore a hole clear through the reinforced hull. I barely got my breather in time. I told her. I said others would come. A rupture threw me clear of the habitat. And the monster turned and bore down on me. And just as its tentacles came within reach, Mader appeared out of nowhere. She had a sea glide in one hand, a jagged piece of scrap metal in the other. She meant to butcher that beast or die trying. The last I saw her, she had the metal lodged in its neck as the monster did its best to shake her, contorting off into the darkness. I'm certain she got her wish. Oh, we can get in another. here. Then... I thought I saw a light deep below me. I hope maybe Bart had swum clear. I followed it. Now I wonder whether I saw anything at all. Our oxygen is low. Wow. The habitat is gone. I can't see the sky. Something surely has the scent of my blood. All right, let's park this guy up here. So that sounds like the end of that guy, and the lady might have died there too. Okay, let's go back. I love the little side story in this game. Just, uh, yeah, the, the little side story with like the people. Absolutely crazy. All right, oh, here we go. Damaged pistol fragment. Scan it, scan it. Got it. I need five more of those, wow. There's another one. Might all be in here. Gotta really look hard. Okay, another data box. Cyclops shield generator. Okay. Oh, there's the thing. We'll go down there in just a second. Okay, another data pad. There we go. With you, risking our lives. Oh, stow it, Chief. The kid can't kill this disease without fish to study. I'm just bringing him home. 
What? Tell her. 30 seconds. Tell her I'm right. You're both wrong. Marguerite, I can't find out how they resist the bacteria if you slaughter them all. It ain't always they oblige in coming in alive. He means you're being reckless. Father, the outcome's no better if we hole up in here and don't go outside. But we have to find a middle way. There is no compromise. Not while she's on my sea base. Your sea base? I'm going outside. Bart, Torical has disembarked the habitat. Bart, come in. It's dangerous. Damn it, boy. I know you can hear me. Chief, oh, orange tablet. Here we go. Chief, get off the radio and put on your helmet. What? Brace! Okay, lots of bad things. Hold on, I gotta go back up. 30 seconds of oxygen. That's four out of five. Alright, where do I go? Where do I go? Where's the ladder? There it is. Okay, get there, get there. Alright, 10 seconds. No, 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 don't die here. Go, 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 go. Woo! That was tight. That was super, super close. Alright, I gotta go in one more time, guys. Let's get this done. Okay, just keep an eye out for one more pistol fragment. There we go. Alright, another PDA. Margaret, Maida has boarded the habitat. What are you so happy about, Maida? Say, kid, I brought you something. Is that a Leviathan outside? Towed it home on the back of the sub. You killed that thing? It's still breathing. I was about to finish the job, but I can stay in chat if you'd like. No. Then make yourself useful and pass me that hardened blade. Are you out of your mind? You brought that thing here? What if it's not as dead as it looks? What if others come? You seconds. prefer it got curious and came of its own accord? Or got messed up and dragged here? When we get off this planet, I am going to drag you through every court in the damn Federation. Oh, I think we found it. There we go. Damage pistol fragment. All right, we got the pistol. I don't know if this is part of the base game or a mod, but I'm really glad we found it. Okay, I think we did get it. Tech pistol. Nice. Comes with a wide array of functionality. Include explosive cannon, laser pistol, target health detection, and incredible resizing ray. <gasps> That's the super pistol. All right. I think we've got everything, guys. I don't know if there's anything else I need to search for here. Does it give me another location after this? I don't see one. All right, we made it back to the base. We had to sacrifice the prawn suit. It's okay. There we go. Oh, eat, eat the one. Okay. I can only eat one at a time. That's fine. There we go. We have survived. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and take a med kit. Use it. All right, we did get some really cool stuff down there. I'm kind of excited about that. Welcome We're going to have to work on getting all this stuff laid out and put out in different places. Uh, we got lots of stuff on us. So we got the carry-all. We got a microscope. Non-functional, but we'll see what it does. Fluid analyzer, also non-functional. Another creature egg and a orange tablet, which I haven't seen yet, which is kind of cool. So we'll get into those kind of things. Uh, man, I, I hate that we had to leave the prawn suit out there, but we will go back and get We'll figure out where we got to go next storyline-wise and where we can go next mod-wise. We also did get the blueprint for the tech pistol. And, oh my god, I can make it. <gasps> That's okay. We're gonna do that first thing in the next episode. We'll have the tech pistol. It has some kind of resizing gun. We'll check that one out. See you guys in the next episode. Thank you so much for the support. Let's